Hey guys, welcome, welcome, welcome. Man, the volume might need to use up. So I want to discuss a few things. Okay, we had um in the last read for the Halloween Eve, okay, or All Saints Day, whatever you want to call it. Um, we have um we had the Eight of Cups walking towards the Ten of Cups, and in between was the Two of Cups, guys. I can't stress enough how destined this situation is. Um, and a lot of people don't want to face it. We have the wheel, we are justice, okay. That's okay, guys. You need to accept that, especially in this energy. I will tell you, um, just because it's destined does not mean the time is now. You still have to release and accept accept that. And this scenario looks like it's definitely coming in, and I can say that because the, the toxicity is being left behind, which is great because a lot of people with the energy that we've been working with lately, it is about um, leaving toxic situations behind, not allowing yourself to be caught up in them, not allowing um, it to be okay. So I'm just looking at my rock with this little, the little face. Um, not, you know, allowing yourself to be put in certain situations. Um, sometimes you know you do have to release and, and let go and um I know it's hard okay and I know this is a destined scenario but what if this person you're dealing with is dealing with proximities and dealing with drug addi addiction or alcohol problems or you know is just battling themselves right now then you know that's not on you to to play that role okay um let the divine take care of that situation and, um, you know, let go of whatever it is you're harboring, okay? Um, just because you know it's destined, it doesn't mean the time is now. So you, you, you have to be able to recognize that type of energy too, okay? You have to lay things to rest. It's, it's Scorpio energy, okay? It's, it's letting things die to have a brand new beginning to go through that transition. Look at, holy shit, why I just cut the deck. The deck. The death and the wheel. Okay? Like, you gotta let go and, and move forward. What the heck just fell here? You gotta let go and move forward. Okay? Um, it's the best advice I can give you if this scenario has not come in for you yet. Because that means there's still something very, very toxic. Okay? Going on. There's still healing that needs to be required so the best advice i can give you is if this person does not come in real soon it is just not your time okay? hi baby um and it is time to to release and, and and let go um so let me see if i can pull my the best advice for you right now hi max hi max all right um So I understand this scenario is destined, okay? Uh, Ace of Pentacles. So I understand you're in a destined, uh, a, a, a destined scenario, but just because it's meant to be and it, it's destiny does not mean that right now is is that destined time. Um, chances are it definitely looks like it is, but if somebody's fighting it, then trust me, you don't you don't want no part of it. So the best advice for you is to take this opportunity that the universe is is giving you, okay? Whether this person comes in or not, the opportunity is here, okay? Um, so take a new start without this person, you know? Like, let go of what it is you need to let go of, all right? Because the universe wants you to be happy, okay? Um, the five of cups in this reverse. So it, again, it's, it's, it's coming out of the disappointment. Okay. Do not, do not carry this energy. How, how is it you can possibly have this beautiful, beautiful new start if you're carrying this energy? All right. We got a lot of guilt too. We got sorrow, not, not releasing uh, what well, we're trying, but you know, you, you gotta try a, a little harder. I know it's easier. I know it's easier said than done, but guys, <laughs> This is so divine. Look, I, I said star because it's a star. 
all right? And you got a big star in the middle of this pentacle. Please let go of what it is you're holding on to. It is not serving you. I, I do not want you to repeat this wheel over again, okay? And wouldn't you rather move on and then in a couple weeks or whenever they come in, you're like, whoa, I'd rather be shocked as shit than to be sitting back and be thinking about my past and not moving forward. You know what I'm saying? Because you know it's destined. So let it just happen when it happens, okay? We have the three of pens. I, again, it's a contract, okay? It's, it's a collaboration. It's coming together. Have that new start, whether this is work, for your destined scenario. I don't know if there was a third party here. Tell me about the three of pence. Um, yeah, the queen of wands and the princess of pence. So it looks like there was probably, for some, there was a third party. It just looks like the queen of wands doesn't want to put, I mean, she's, she's pissed. Um, queen of wands in this deck reversed. She's beyond pissed. She's willing to take a pinnacle, though. To me, this is saying, get your, get your youth back. Get, get that vibe back. Get that, get that soul back. You know, like, tell me about the Prince of Pence. Because that's the same person with that energy is. For some, it's a third party. But it's not It's not really like that, all right? It's, yeah, and this person's coming back around after they stabbed you in the back. So maybe there was somebody there that you didn't know about and others did know about it. Okay. Um, but this is a contract that can't be broken. You got to confront karma to break the contract. And if you want this new start to work together with this person, you have to come out of that anyway. It looks like a lot of you are, but it's like, don't think if you take a new start elsewhere that it's just going to be all like bubble gums and rainbows because it most certainly won't. This is Scorpio energy, ladies and gents. What, what's going on right now is you need to literally bury things in the casket. Picture a damn casket, okay? And bury it in the casket. Throw dirt on it. Like for real, like you need to bury this. It's done, all right? Let it go. Let bygones be bygones. When this person comes back, whether you have the new stat or not, you need to hash out karma. Tell me about the Ace of Pence. Some of you, there is a third-party scenario, and, and now is not time, regardless of how destined it is, but they're still giving you a new opportunity. So when it does come back, don't be foolish and take it, especially if a third party just went down. Okay, um, so this is somebody's, this is like a wish, all right, this Ace of Pence is, it's, it's, it's destiny, I mean, it's in your contract, it's, it's what you wanted, it's what you signed up for, believe it or not, you know, it's like, believe it or not, that's exactly what you did, you signed up for it, and I'm telling you right now, if there was a third party, recently within the last few months, now is not the time, this person will try to come back around because of the energy, it's on you whether or not you want to repeat that will, but I'm telling you, it's not time. No, no matter how destined it is, it, it, that is not time. Um, if this has been a while and this person comes back, then, you know, again, you signed up for it. Do your best, all right? Best advice, best advice. Do your best to, do your best to, to move forward. Okay. Make your own judgment call. Forgive what needs to be forgiven. And this also can be reconciliation. This is this is also healing. It's it's forgiving. It's you make this call as an individual. Like, do you want this? Like, this is what you signed up for. Okay. I bury what needs to be buried. Damn, too many. So work with the Scorpio energy, guys. Okay. Go go through the rebirth. Go through, wow. Hello. Go through the rebirth. All that stuff. Um. Somebody took advantage of the situation for sure, and to me, this is saying you're definitely harboring something too. Tell me about the four of cups. Yeah, y you know, walk away from what you're harboring. All right, so it it's it's the same energy, but 
you signed up for this, okay? And, and, and now it's it's your judgment call on, on what it is you want to do because it looks like the offer is going to come back around. So I don't know what you want to do, but you got to be smart enough to know whether it's time or not with this scenario, okay? You got to, you just, you got to know. Ten of cups. All right, it's balancing out the scales. See, it's the devil again reversed. So this person came out of toxicity. They soul search. Okay, it's the king of wands. So, like I said, if it's been a while, then it's just a meant to be scenario. If this is just, it went down within like the last three months, four months. It, it's not, this person, there's no way there's been growth, okay? Not, not like that. You would only know your own scenario. But what I'm trying to say is just because it's destined does not mean now is the time, okay? If it comes in, please address it. Some of you do not want to address this situation and you don't have any choice right now, but to address it if it comes, okay? Um, and, and not to mention the energy, you know, so release what you're holding on to. Don't stop yourself from a beautiful brand new start. And with the, the Nine of Cups there too, this is being abundant all the way around, okay? Um, it's a beautiful scenario it, if you can look at it that way. Um, I know, again, easier said than done, but um, it truly, it, it truly is, okay? Looks like there's a little fear on somebody's behalf, too, okay? But coming out of that fear at the same time, which is great. Um, let me just get one card for you, your best advice for this scenario. It's love. Um, it's the lovers, and and this one, it's not about a choice. It, this is, this is harmony. Take time to experience what love feels like, instead of pushing it away. They truly want you to experience it. Okay. So. Whatever fear you're holding on to. It, it's time to let go. It's the wheel of fortune. It's the flow. Release the old cycles. Okay. Um, it's like this card means that your heart's calling out to you. All right. It's changing is believing. Okay. Like yeah. go with the flow, guys. Look at the compass. It's just the wheel of fortune. Like love. It, there's, there's no avoiding <laughs> this scenario as, as much as some of you definitely um, want to. Okay? It, the tower came in already. It's, it's time to rebuild. Go rebuild your lives. Okay? Again, live in the moment. All right, take time to experience what can happen all over again. All right, go with the flow. Move forward. All right, forward movement. Follow the compass. Don't try to fight it. Release whatever needs to be released. Let those old cycles go. All right. It's, it's time to rebuild. It's definitely time to rebuild. Okay. So, you know, it's three major arcana too. All right. And it's two seven. So... I wish you the very best. All right, release what needs to be released, please. This is the perfect, the perfect energy. And if something horrible just went down, like I said, and you got to let someone go of an addiction and stuff like that, let them work on them while you work on you, okay? Because now is just not the time for, for it to come together, even though it's destined. For others, it, it most certainly is the time, all right? The, the two of you are at your age, the two of you want the 10, and the two of you have mutual feelings for each other. Okay, so go with the flow, address it, see what happens. I love you guys.